So we are at... Downtown Front Royal. I suck with names. <laughs> We just stopped and we realized that they have like some street festival thing going on. This so, always happens, so I'm I'm excited. Yeah, so we're so gonna go going. check out the street festival too. In and, downtown uh, Front Do some shopping. Let's see what happens. Alright, let's go. I'm asking up. I think somebody's about to do a little ditty over here. So I got lots of goodies from this place. Oh, I'm gonna film you. Some sodas. Let's go see what Matt thinks about this. I got some goodies locally owned. I got you Oh. A soda pop. Nice. I love myself a good pop. <laughs> we don't say pop. <laughs> Cinnamon roll that they're famous for. Okay. So, so I got that. This is the first thing I'm eating. Get away from my piece. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It, it was good. Wow. Hey. They have all kinds of flavors up there. All right. All right. <laughs> So these are the lines on the weekend to get into Shenandoah National Park all day. Crazy. That is freaking crazy. And it, we heard, and, and I didn't believe it when I heard it, but I do now, that on the weekends lately, it's been up to like a two, three hour wait time. So I'm glad that we have made the decision to go during the week and not go during the weekend. Yeah, that's the benefit of that's... our schedule. Poop free. Oh my god. Are you, what are you doing? We're gonna go see what's up there. What keeps falling. So the whole time we've been here, it's been bang, 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 bang on the top of the coach. And I had a dream about it. There's definitely like some mold up here. It's not too bad. And to put that into perspective, this is the hat. <laughs> Good morning, Adaptive Humanity family. So as you guys most know by now, we don't really plan our travel day. So we have an end location. We just say, all right, we have four or five days to get there. We give ourselves plenty of time. We just go wherever the road takes us. And we have had a hell of a time in Virginia getting campgrounds anywhere. But as you guys also know, we are a huge fan of Harvest Hosts and what these small businesses have to offer we came in late last night we are at a racetrack so we are in southern virginia right now the owner of the place is this amazing guy that started this racetrack about 50 years ago and it's ran by him and his son and we are gonna get some good old-fashioned dirt circle track racing in tonight this is what it looks like so we're gonna have some fun tonight amber told me where we were Roll, roll. <laughs> yep, she jacked it up, and she's the one that knows where we are. Roll, how? Why can't Royal? I say it now? Roll, roll. Why can't I say it now? Car. Yeah. 
you gotta run and save Skippy before he ends up losing another leg. <laughs> Stop chasing him. Skip, come on, buddy. Skip likes this game. Skip, come on. Did you get the Royal, Royal race? Royal. <laughs> two nights at this harvest host it was very special one super unique but it was at least very entertaining we loved it. it was really cool my first like race race matt was so giddy about it so it was amazing but um so now we're about to attempt our descend to the next destination what's that noise <laughs> It's so annoying! So this is where we're trying to go down. Yes, that's a drop. And we lost the brakes on the Jeep. <laughs> round two. Hopefully it's not round three. Okay, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was. We're just gonna coast down. Tippy, tippy, we're at a tip. Oh my god. Oh Tippy, my god. Tippy. I'm gonna throw up. I don't like it. <laughs> Looks are super deceiving. And then when you're inside of this thing, you genuinely feel that you're gonna tip. So we were traveling. This is one of our travel days. We stopped at a KOA. I don't remember. What town are we in? Right now, yeah. we're in Baileyton. Okay, so it's about two hours from Asheville because we're gonna go up to the top of... Mount Mitchell. Yep. So we're only staying here for a day or two. Um, and, and we go to get in the Jeep to leave. The Amber goes, hey babe, you know that thing is misting, right? So, misting? No. So I walk over and it's not from my fitting. It's from there. And it's blowing on the electrical box. So we're just gonna shut that off. It can't be a good thing, just saying. Mitchell and I can tell you I already don't like it it's too many people here there's Starbucks up here yeah <laughs> it's it's freaking packed but bullshit barely found a spot to park 
They need to make it harder to get up here. Oh, they go weed these people out. Ready for this, this amazingly challenging hike. 73 miles uphill. I think this is the hardest walk of the day. Get up here. Mount Mitchell, highest peak of Mississippi River. Let's stand up here. There we go. It's so pretty. Stand in front of me. Oh. Hello. Oh, you got it. Yes. It smells so good in here, but it is completely insane. We're like, oh, we'll be good because we're going on Monday. Wrong. You know what? We summited. <laughs> yeah, right. We summited. We made it. Half-ass summit that I've ever done in the, my life. The fastest place we've been in and out. But anyway, we did it. We drove an hour up here for three minutes up there. Ooh. So worth it. Yeah, but this is insanity. All right, I'm freaking hungry. Yep. And I know you're hangry yep. on top of everything else. So let's go find a place to eat. Throw down the window. Throw down the window so you can see. I it's hard to tell on the camera, but there's not, it's just like a straight cliff. Oh my God, why are there so many cars? They're hiking up. That one, oh my God, they're all gonna fall off. One more step right here. Like it, thank you. Oh, thank you, we're happy to have you. Up here. A nice little view. Okay, so this place, the menu, you literally scan a QR code. So you have touch menus. It's freaking awesome. It's been a long day. Yeah. So we celebrate with a drink. Thank <laughs> you. 